It was one of those commutes that turned small hills into impassable mountains. By 4 p.m., 235 was a mess. Traction was bad, visibility was worse. By rush hour, it was a route many tried to avoid altogether in search of a path with less resistance, which led to possibly the worst traffic jam Grand Avenue has ever seen. Now, I've lived in Des Moines my entire life, and this is just ridiculous. <laughs> I've been out in blizzards, and traffic has been moving better than this. Unless you experienced it. What is going on? I have no idea. Blizzard? Craziness? It's hard to explain how bad it was. Almost three hours. Almost three hours. Almost everyone we spoke to was traveling, or trying to travel, from downtown to their homes in West Des Moines. We caught up with people, it wasn't hard to do, at 49th Street, only 40 blocks west of downtown. I left the Grimes State Office building, and um, it's been two hours. So and I just need to get to West Des Moines, that's all. How long does it usually take you to get home? Um, 15 minutes. <laughs> An accident at 63rd and Grand didn't help, neither did the hills, or the snow, or all the drivers who just wanted to avoid 235. I heard that the freeway was creeping along too, so <laughs> I feel safer here. I'm used to this. I grew up in Iowa. 